Every time we have initiated, Linda who lost Cedric, Riley who lost Salvato, Beverly who lost Alonzo. We pledged when our children became falsified police reports, became eulogy, painting displayed on concrete canvas. T-shirts. Members must have buried a loved one at the hands of police brutality. The club we never wanted to join. I pledged on Christmas Eve when the sirens came screaming at my door. I wish I could trade my breath for Tyrell's life. I pledged on August 30th, leaves were falling in slow motion like Kayla's delicate bones collapsed at the impact of hollow tips. The, the police have put on a puppet show for too long, taking the flesh and bone out of beautiful souls, toying with our sanity. Autopsies resemble large games of tic-tac-toe, create a fictional storyline and cut out whatever 86 minutes of reality they chose. Tossed us around and framed our children's murders into malicious entertainment. Members must be prepared to tell the real story of their loved one. No matter how painful it is, the fury made the tears run away from my eyes faster <laughs> than Tyrell ran from his killer. Kayla never believed in fairy tales. Hard to fantasize when you see violence everywhere. She asked me if I had a dream she could borrow. Kayla never got to see it. Souls will speak forever. Members will stay vigilant in their pursuit of justice. We are haze on a daily basis, forced to identify the bodies taken away from us. Many a loop to broken images. So we kiss our children's graves. Money is no object, but our baby's last toy is a coffin. I forgot how to grieve. We don't have alarm clocks anymore. Time is different. Time is endless. Hours are concrete. Trying to find a coffin is tucking them in one last time. It's Tyrell's crooked smile. The way he always wrinkled his shirt right after I ironed it. Is texting your child. I love you. An hour before their murder. Time is never getting a response. Members are committed to the responsibility bestowed on them upon joining the parents club. On these podiums. Preserve his purity. Rub my angel on my chest so they'll never fade away. Cannot remove the bullets lodged in her blossoming brain. Maybe, Maybe if I had made her stay inside. inside. I could have followed her cap and gown before I did her casket. So we never stop, never settle. Live by our own, die by our babies. Every step I take is towards justice for my son. Every breath I have is one taken away from my daughter. Oh, but our faith will make sure there's 